This is 605 Tennessee, slightly smaller than 601 Tennessee. So as soon as you come up, you enter one of the main living areas. Pretty narrow here. We'll go back there where it opens up. But when you first get up here, you definitely have to turn the corner to get to anywhere where there's any space. It almost puts you out directly on a fairly large back porch. And as you can see down there, they had a bunch of custom patio work done. I don't know how much that would cost. It looks like, you know, $5,000 or something. All right. Also, when you come up, if you turn right, you get to one of your rooms. And it has also an entrance to the back porch, screened in back porch. There you go. Has a, a rain shower head as well as a standard uh, shower head. And even though it's small, Jack and Jill sinks. And here's a, probably a half bath. Yeah, a very deep uh, powder room. Here's the main uh, living room. I would say it's 15 feet wide, but it's probably 30 feet long. A lot of sunshine. And, well, let's show you the view just looking out from the kitchen to the front. It's all windows, which I really love. And this front porch is huge, Giselle. And the, the other house, 605, 601 Tennessee, that's being built, it's going to actually wrap around um, <clears throat> because it's the corner lot. This thing is about six feet wide it's room for real furniture and rocking chairs and everything I know you're not that excited about a front porch but I, I must say you're looking at it all brand new real estate and palm trees and it's nice it's a nice feel to sell and to be able to wrap around I don't know it, it sets it apart someday when you, the home has to be sold in 15 years the wraparound porch is a big deal just so you know It's a pause, it continues right where we left off. All right. So uh, up here you get to the first room and it shares a bathroom, the standard tile, not high end but really nice. And two different sinks in here and it shares it with the other bedroom up here which opens directly out to a second level deck. <clears throat> Then it connects to the hallway from where the stairs came up. Really liking the floors too, by the way, Giselle. And a slightly bigger, not slightly, a significantly bigger bedroom on the upper level on the other side with its own large and walk-in closet. It goes back, oh, seven feet. Yeah, this is the master. Uh, also, two shower heads, one rain. And this is, is it marble or? I think it's tile. I think it's tile.
And Giselle, I know there's no ocean view from here, but I'm going to just step out here anyway and take a look just in case. Nope, but if there's lightning storms, you'll have quite a, quite a view from here of lightning storms and the sunrise, perhaps. There you go, 605 Tennessee.